Folks, this is Ron, field agronomist with Pioneer in Central Texas, looking at a corn plot. One of the questions I get this time of year is, Ron, did my corn pollinate? You can see looking down the row, a beautiful field with some chrome varieties in it. Real aggressive silkers. You can notice the long extended silks. Great weather this year, so one of the things you can do if you want to check that before you get to brown silk, is to be very careful with a knife. I always like to wear gloves. And take and split the ear very carefully like I've done right here. Then you take and remove the husk ever so gently, like I'm trying to do right here, very carefully. Turn the ear upside down like this, and any of the silks that are still attached have not pollinated. The rest of them that did have. So this ear is partially pollinated at this point. That was a 113 day pioneer. Let's look at this 117 day uh, competitor. Hmm. Interesting in maturities. We got 113 day next to 117 day competitive product and the 117 day shows to be a little further along in maturity. Interesting to see that. How about this hybrid right here? What are we gonna see with that? Still a ways to go, but a lot of kernels have pollinated on this particular ear. Man, that's an awesome sized ear. You almost always see a few there at the tip like we have right here. That's uh, very normal. Let's look at this 109 day pioneer. It's pollinated very similar to the 117 day competitor. And that's a nice looking ear on 0924. So again, has my corn pollinated? There's a very quick and nice way to check. Hope that helps. Thank you for your business. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.